Hi, my name is Adrian Cyrus, and I wrote this spoken word poem. It's so, it's about my dad who is having trouble with the Parkinson's disease. If you know what that is, it's like when you get the disease, you stutter, you like tremor a lot, you really walk, like it's hard for you to walk, hard for you to drive. It's like kind of like you don't really, you always want to kind of like, like you're, you feel weak in your legs and stuff. You kind of want to like just stay at home. You get a depression. You don't think you have any friends or anymore. And also my dad has that. And he also has this thing that the doctors cannot find out. He has headaches like every single day. And the doctors don't really know like what is happening or what it is and because they haven't really seen that before so it's kind of like double the parkinson's because with the headaches it really it really like hurts him a lot i guess so yeah this um poem is about my dad living through it and like how our relationship like we i always like we haven't had been having a good relationship in the past but now I'm always trying to like tighten my relationship before he like passes away so yeah so here it goes my dad can't be with his family 6,000 miles away it's hard for him to handle everyone says push through it it's hard to just get out of hard to talk hard to walk even hard to use chop no cue just stay the same Everyone has to go through pain like doctors think it's a game. You shouldn't need more money, have a better chance of living. Like Muhammad Ali, no, that's a killing. Like that feeling that you get when you're kneeling to the floor. Knowing that your dad might not be able to live no more. You stole a human, stole a person. You don't need to think that you're always getting worse. And remember that 4.0 GPA at UCLA. You don't always need to think that your future is getting gray. Because today, we are going to say that we are going to be together the rest of the way. Can you walk? Can you not? Can you talk? Well, please don't say that you fell again. Can you draw? Can you draw? Can you use knives? It's okay, you don't have to tell. Because the bells are ringing, the bells are singing to us. I promise you will always have my trust. I promise you will always have my trust. Because the bells are ringing, the birds are singing to us. I promise you will always have my trust. I promise you will always have my trust. He doesn't get bullied, he just gets lonely. What would we do if you had a life like this? Always trying to be with your kid, not knowing what to do with those seven hours when he's not home. But well, what can you do with those weak bones? You're just kind of like a stone. That's how you feel when you're my dad. You always just feel sad, so why don't you come and try to be him for it sad? He still has feelings. You can see it, you can feel it. If you ain't stupid like a fool, you know you should have knew it. Just keep trying to fight it. Keep trying to bite it. Keep trying to do what you want from you. Start acting like it's the flu. Cause I know it is, I know it could go away This disease is giving me too much to say Now all I want to say is Can you walk, can you not, can you talk well Please don't say that you fell again Can you draw, can you draw, can you use knives nice? It's okay, you don't have to tell Cause the bells are ringing, the birds are singing to us I promise you will always have my trust I promise you will always have my trust. Oh, cause the bells are ringing, the birds are singing to us. I promise you will always have my trust. I promise you will always have my trust. I really hope I could go to Washington DC with him because he's been dreaming to go there for a while. So thank you, hope you enjoyed it.